Hi guys. Well, you seen from the title, I am doing my Sephora Play subscription box. This is actually my first one that I ever got. I was on the waiting list for I don't know how long, and then um, they emailed me, and I don't know what happened. I put all my um, you know information in, and then it said um, that I had to be on the waiting list again. I guess I didn't do it quick enough. So finally, after a couple months. They sent me another email, and I was able to get my information in, and then my box, I got it yesterday. So, I am excited. The only thing I did was cut it. I haven't peeked in there. If you watched my last video, I've been doing very good. So, let's get to it. Okay, so when you open the box, this is what it looks like. I'm excited. And this, I guess, yeah. This is like a brochure or, you know, it, t it tells you what everything is and stuff. Okay, that's good. I love when, when um, subscription boxes do that. This is what the bag looks like. Let's glow your own way. Let's open this puppy up. Okay. The first thing I see, it's like perfume. This is from Divine... Clementine, yeah, okay, I don't know what this, I don't know what this smells like, I don't care for it too much, let's see what this says. Um, it's inspired by the California coast. This scent sparkles with ripe citrus. Okay, maybe that's what it smells like. And a suggestion of sunny, delicate florals. Okay. I don't care for it too much, but I do like getting little samples like this because I, you know, like you keep a little bag like this or a smaller bag. And then what I do is I put a whole bunch in a bag and I put it in my, oh God, I can smell that. Um, and I put it in my pocketbook, you know, for days, you know, you need some or somebody else, you know, needs a little cologne or perfume you know you don't have to say so much like you know you stink or whatever you could just say oh why don't you try this and put put some of this on try this see if you like this you know kind of play it off a little bit yeah so awesome I do like but I might give that away a little too strong for me okay then we got oh from Josie Moran this is a surreal skin Oregon finishing bomb okay um, so I guess it's a primer. Um, as either the first or last step in your makeup routine, press into the skin with gentle patting motion using your fingers or a sponge. We love how it looks taped in the cheekbones or used as a glow. Oh, okay. Let's try to get this open. Um, Yes, it's game changing makeup with skincare hybrid primes and finishes with the whip formula for. Okay, yeah, so it's more like a highlighter, I guess. Let's see. Come on. Oh, wow, that kind of feels funny. Let's see. Doesn't have a smell. Doesn't really have a glow either. Let me turn my light on and see. Yeah, I, I, I would use this more as like a primer. Yeah, that's what it looks like. That's what I think I would do. Play around with it a little bit. Okay. Then we have, what is this? It says ghost oil. What is that? Okay. This is a transparent um, hair oil that smooths, frizz, and delivers. Shines for sleek, satiry hair for roots to end. Huh, if you watch my other video, I have got some uh, hair products out of my Ipsy bag, and I'm just saying, I mean, this didn't come at the right time. So it's like a little oil, you know, for your hair, which, nice size sample. I'm happy about that. Okay. Then, oh, what's, I uh, got a what's up from Benefit. This is, I think, a highlighter, cream to powder highlighter. So far, my God, between this and Ipsy, I'm really liking that. Okay, that's what that looks like. Nice size sample. I like that. Let's put it on this. Okay. Uh, yeah. Can you see that? Look at that. That's from my Ipsy bag. Um, actually, once it dries, 
um, the Tardius Pro lipstick, it you, look, it doesn't move at all. So I like that. It doesn't smudge. But yeah, that highlighter, that is popping. I will be trying this. Love it. I think there's two more things in here. Okay, then we got the, um, okay, uh, sample of the Urban um, Decay, the primer for your eyes. Oh, that phone. Every time I want to um, do video. Little. Okay. Uh, I'm going to put this on pause and turn my phone off. I'll be right back, guys. Sorry. Okay, I'm back, guys. Sorry about that. As I was saying, this is a little sample. And it's funny because um, I think it was Sephora is having a big sale for the anti-aging one. For the big one, $8. And it's normally, what, $20? Um, for the regular one, it's still $20. And I think another one, I think, is like $12. But for some reason, the biggest one, the anti-aging, was like $8. So I ordered one. And I do have this as well. And it works great. Love it. Yeah, the one I have has like a wand, but can never go with too many, uh, can't go wrong with having too many um, eyeshadow primers. Love it. And the last thing, oh, from Glam Glow. This is um, like a moisturizer, eliminating uh, moisturizer. Okay. And that is a two-in-one moisturizer and illuminator. Hydrates, blurs, and enhances any complexion with the lit from within finish. Oh, I dropped that. Oh, my God. Can you believe it? Under the table, guys. Excuse me. Oh, my God. Jesus. How embarrassing is that? <laughs> okay. Let's see what that is. I like this Sephora thing because with Ipsy, you get some stuff. But with Sephora, you get a lot of the brand names and you get to try. Oh, God. I put too much on. Oh, God. You get to try things out, you know. Wow, can you see that? Oh, kind of got mixed in with the other one, but love it. Okay, let's recap what I got. I am so excited. Okay, I got the hair oil. Love it. I got the Glam Glow, uh, like the two-in-one lotion. Love it. I got from Benefit. This is new, I think, actually. I got the, um, what do you call it, highlighter. I got a sample of the eyeshadow, you know, the Urban Decay um, eyeshadow primer. I got from Josie Moran. I got, I'm going to use that as a primer. And then I got this stinky uh, perfume. Somebody might like it. So that is in my Sephora play bag. I am like so excited, you know. All right. Well, I will. Um, I don't know if I can list a link below. I'll try. I don't know if it's back on a waiting list or not. I'm not sure. So don't quote me on that. But anyway, um, subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Like and comment. And if you comment, I will write you back. See ya.